this is the fourth example in unfolding series and this component is having uh, seven bends that is one two three four five six and seven if you have such a uh, multi bends and if you feel this uh, is very complicated I suggest you create a pre-bending uh, hand sketch of the pre-bendings and you can get the angles of pre-bends in that if you do the calculation properly I have done this uh, sketch and this will make uh, designing much more easier for this profile I had I have planned a, a pre-bend almost 45 degrees and for this profile I have planned a pre-bend of three I mean three stages initially I will be doing uh, unfolding of 35 degree because at 35 when you unfold to 35 degree the axis of this bend will become parallel to the stroke this is actually a, a 105 degree and in next I will unfold it to 42 degree move in that stage uh, this particular bend will be parallel to the stroke that will be uh, and again we will be unfolding to 11 degree because at this stage this phase will be parallel to the base phase and finally we will be unfolding the hole to this particular degree I will show you how to do this in uh, UGNX open the part in from the prescribed folders steady the part well so one two three four five six and seven bent as I said earlier go to progressive die wizard convert it to a sheet metal this is the base phase I planned and click apply UG has uh, found nine bends we need to merge bend 3 and bend 1 uh, select those bends click on the merge bends and click apply I merge this bends because both the axis of this bend is in uh, is in same line next we need to merge these two bends click merge bends and then apply finally we got seven bends and we will be doing a pre-bending operation so uh, first I will select this bend click on define pre-bends I will be using a 45 degree when you select two number of bends you need to mention only one degree and a starting edge we need to select so I am going to select the starting edge as this and click apply Uh, this bend is now divided into two then uh, I'm going to divide this bend into two we need to select this bend and then click 30 degree then click the starting edge I'm using this as the starting edge and click apply now we need to define pre-bends for this bends click on the bend then we need to specify uh, four bends and we need to define three bend angles first is a 35 degree bend then 
of 42 and finally 11 degree I have uh, explained you how I uh, zero in on this degrees so now we need to select from edge I'm going to select this as from edge and click apply then we need to define pre-bend for this angle also I'm going to divide uh, this into three bends first a 40 degree and then a 43 degree I'm going to select the edge and click apply now we define uh, all the pre-bends if you feel you have missed something then you can always come back to uh, this direct unfolding and define the pre-bends now click cancel you have to define intermediate stages uh, I plan for a 12 number of intermediate stages with a pitch uh, 110 in X direction and I have set the stage sequence from to from part to blank click OK now uh, in this stage the I'll do the parting off and I'll keep this as an idle so I, I need to work on from this uh, intermediate stage onwards first I'll be unbending uh, this side and for unbending you need to click uh, select the intermediate stage then click on the bend show alternate result click OK and select on the intermediate stage, uh, stage and then click on click apply and we need to again unbend that one in this stage so what I've done is uh, from this flat area there will be uh, a bending of bending of V shaped here and here and then finally we will get this bend in this stage so next uh, again we need to do unbend click on unbend select the intermediate stage and here will be uh, sorry I have select the wrong intermediate stage I select the intermediate stage and do the unbending of this click on apply then we'll start unbending this bend select this stage click on the click on show alternate result so click on apply so this is the stage we'll be bending this this profile and after that profile uh, after this bend we will be doing a bending operation here a bending operation here
we need to define unbend for this click on ok so next we will unfold this region once again select on the intermediate stage and click on sometimes UG will throw an error message in that case uh, we need to select both the bends click on apply so select the intermediate stage here this one here uh, unbending of here uh, the part will be I mean this two bends will be formed so we need to un unform I mean unbend in this stage select the bends show alternate I also planned uh, pre-bending of this profile I'm selecting the intermediate stage and click apply and last unbending of this bend selecting the intermediate stage and then click on apply and then I'm going to unbend make this one as a flat now we have to unbend this component I mean in this stage I'll be unbending this bent show alternate click on apply and if we feel that we cannot bend to this much degree uh, I'm going to unbend this uh, this bend in this stage And finally, we'll get a, f a f flat blank in this stage. Click apply. So, uh, so I'll so let's again recheck what we have done is correct or not first we got uh, this is the fully blank then we'll be doing uh, two pre-bends to get this angle 
then again a bend that may convert this shape to parallel to the base face then a pre-bend upside then finally we'll be bending this this bend We'll be doing this bend and then in next stage this again a pre-bend here. We will finalize this bending in this stage. Then this is the final bend to get this profile. And finally, when this profile is bent, well, there's a small bend in this stage. And on the other side, there's no much change uh, till this stage. Then there will be a, a V bend here and here. And finally, this formed in this stage. And this is parting and the final component will be coming out of the die. Next we will see example number 5 